So these guys are all right here at the gate waiting for us to take out these guys. They just came probably five minutes ago. Look at this little baby. Look how precious. It's all right, little guy. You guys are going to be nice to the new little ones, aren't you? You better be. I'm going to be watching you. The cows are down there enjoying the sun. At least some of them are. The rest are probably back in the field. Okay, Paul's here, so I better do the door. So they're just inspecting the new ones. We still have two more to put in. Paul's taking a breather. <laughs> so this one right here is new. There's two. Uh, actually, there's three. Uh, okay, there's three right in this little grouping that are new. Just curious. Here comes another little new one. So far they seem to be doing okay. So far so good. So, they have to learn to feed her. Yeah. Oh, they'll learn that quick. Yeah, the little one hit the fence. They'll learn it really quick. Little babies. That one is really little. It'll be interesting to see if uh, this one right here is really little. The bigger ones will show the little ones how to do it. So this one right here, Graham, he had one of the pigs step on his one arm and he had fluid in it, like bubbles of fluid. It looks like they've gone down, almost gone, which is great. So far, that one, Graham, is the only one that we've named so far. I wonder if, should you put some food in that bowl down there? Or would the big ones just go over and eat it? They'll figure it out. Yeah. They can get the big ones out of the way. <laughs> the cleanup crew. They have to learn how to do the water too. I would think they're probably thirsty from their ride. Yeah. You want... yeah. Do you want me to go in and swish it around? No, I gotta bring the hose back to clean out. Okay. 
Sounds good. I mean, a couple of them are pretty small, but um, some of them aren't as small as I thought they'd be. So there will be some pecking order stuff here, especially where the food is concerned. But we always have food in there, so I mean, even if they get pushed away now, they'll always be able to go and eat. Their endless supply. Somebody's sneezing. Somebody's down there touching the wire. It's not it's not the one that was doing it earlier, it's a different one that hit it. Just me. Oh yeah, I see what you mean where they're cleaning it up on the ground. Yeah. I know, <laughs> that's what I was thinking. None of the little ones are coming over for it. But they're over there thinking, good, we can get to the food. Ah, I hear somebody opening it. Knuckleheads. You guys are pigs, not chickens. So one of the little ones started to go over to get a drink and then changed its mind. Probably because all the big ones are over there. Still the big ones drinking out of it.
They'll figure it out. Touching the wire. It's not getting shocked. I turned the fence off. Oh, okay. It's going to say it's not working. <laughs> you want me to go do it? Jeez, don't hurt yourself. There's a little pecking order baloney going on. Oh, it's nice to see the little ones eating. At least attempting to. Yeah, they're all trying to get in the same one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the really little ones in there. The one that you said, even though it's the smallest one, it's real smart. Mm -hmm. It would be interesting to see, because remember we had Tiny last well, year? That's, that's, I think that was two years ago. From was the other place ago? in Allentown. I said, I said, that one's kind of small. I said, ah. sometimes they, a few months in, you can't even tell the difference. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they always lag behind. I'll tell you. Because Tiny really took off. Was it, was it peanut? Was it peanut? I think it was tiny. tiny. Yeah, peanut sounds better. I think peanut. But peanut was not a peanut. Just peanut's face. <laughs> so rude. Yeah. Yeah. Makes me feel happy. Yeah, so Graham's arm looks much oh, better. better. Yeah. yeah. And it's doing good. I mean, that's, yeah. that's a solid pig. Yeah. It's all natural. <laughs> it only takes them a couple times hitting it and they don't anymore. They're so smart. Sometimes too smart. <laughs> So when are we going to move them back to the woods? Yeah, until the end of May, once things start growing deep. It'll probably be the first or second week of May. So when, uh, are we getting more fish before we move them back? Um, yeah. I'm hoping by the last week of April to have like maybe 20 more. Okay. So those 20, will they be too small to go back? No. No, because it'll be warmer. We'll make sure that they're in here at least for a few days to so get, you know what a fence is. Yeah, so they don't run through it when they hit it. Yeah. So the little ones are hungry. So this, they, it actually turned out better than I thought it would. I was really worried. The day? No, the day's great. I'm talking about the introduction of the little ones and with the bigger ones. No, it, it, been, it could be not like much that worse. One here where it was, it was like terrible. A battle. Yeah. yeah. So far, they don't really. There's a little nip in here or there. Mm -hmm. Like the pecking order. But they're not mean. They're not being mean. Oh, scared me. Is that the same one that just did it? I'm not sure.
ones that we've had are really looking good. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to put them back in the on grass when the grass is long enough for them. They're going to love that. Yeah, the little ones are getting their food, and the big ones seem like they're settling down. Nice and calm, just how we like it, for the most part. bet the rest of them are right on the other side of the pond. You know what? I'm going to go look. That's my guess. I don't want to disturb them though. Pretty girls. Hey, pretty girls. Hey, pretty girl. Here's America. She's a first calf heifer. It'll be neat to see what she has. down here. So the hill here is blocking the wind. It's a pretty windy day. Hey pretty girl. Very feminine face. <gasps> oh, there's some more back there. <laughs> girls enjoying the sun? Huh? Are you girls enjoying the sun? Hey Frosty. This is Frosty. Frosty is Jill's daughter. Jill is, um, she's been with us the longest. She's an Erica cow. Can you hear Frosty's noises? She's content. So usually Jill is right by Frosty. So Jill's either eating or she's, I bet that's her right there. Hey girls.
I was wrong. That's Jill right there. Oh my goodness. I was starting to get worried the way she's laying there. I thought something was wrong with her. <laughs> Sorry to disturb you, girl. Just want to make sure you're okay. It's all right. Glad you're alive. I bet you can hear the wind in the video. It's pretty windy. Ooh, look how wet the ground is over here. So I know it's still really cold, but I shut our heat off today and opened our windows. It's like one of those days that you just want the fresh air. Even 
though it's so cold. Paul's up keeping watch on the pigs, making sure they're okay, adjusting. I love this. He put in a new post, so I don't have to open the gate. I can just walk through here. It's perfect. All the big ones are out here and all the little ones went into the little area over there.